Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel Pabli. So in this video, we are going to learn how to automatically create pin in Pinterest from Facebook post. So the idea here is that whenever you create a new post in your Facebook account, automatically the same post should be created as a pin in your Pinterest account. So how I have done this, first let us check this in the real time and then I will tell you the integration process. So this is my Facebook page name Pabli Tech. And this is my Pinterest account where I have three pins over here. So now I want that whenever I create a new post over here in my Facebook page, automatically the post should be created as a new pin here in my Pinterest account. So I'm just going to create a new post over here. I'm just going to select an image from my system. Okay, let us select this one. I'm just going to give the caption as Pabli Connect. Core integrations. Okay, and now let's click on post. And here we can see that a new post has been created. Now let us check our Pinterest account. I'm going to just refresh it. Okay, and here we can find four pins. A new pin has been created over here. So now here you might be wondering that I just created a new post here in my Facebook page. And automatically the same post has been created as a new pin here in my Pinterest account. So how did I manage to do this? So let me tell you, this has become possible just because of the automation and integration process. So in order to create an integration between Facebook and Pinterest, we are going to use a software application named Pabli Connect. So basically Pabli Connect is an automation and integration software which will help us in integrating Facebook with Pinterest automatically. The best part here is, it doesn't require any coding skills or programming knowledge. Even a non-technical person can use this software application very easily. So first we have to create an integration between Facebook and Pabli Connect. Then Pabli Connect is going to capture the details of the post that you have created in your Facebook account. And using all those details, automatically a new pin will be created into your Pinterest account. And in this way, we will be learning that how we can create an integration between Facebook and Pinterest using Pabli Connect. So let us learn the integration process now. For this, let us type P-A-B-B-L-Y Pabli.com in our browser. This is the website of Pabli. Here we have to come to products and click on Pabli Connect. This is the landing page of Pabli Connect. As you are the first time user, you have to click on sign up for free option. You can create your own account in just 2 minutes by clicking on this option. As I already have an account with Pabli Connect, I will simply click on Sign In. In the All Apps section, come to Pabli Connect and click on Access Now. This is the dashboard of Pabli Connect. Here we have to create a workflow. For that, come to this plus sign and click on Create Workflow. Here we have to give a name to the workflow. So let us give the name as Facebook and Pinterest integration. Here you can give the workflow name as per your requirement and simply click on create. Here we can see a trigger window and an action window. So Pabli Connect works on the concept of trigger and action. Trigger means when this happens, action means do this. So in this use case, we want the details to be captured from Facebook pages. So open this trigger window and here in the application name, let us find Facebook pages. In the trigger event, we have to select new post. Click on connect. Click on add new connection and click on connect with Facebook pages. Authorization successful. And now the Facebook pages are connected to Pabli Connect just because I was already logged into my Facebook account. So make sure before creating a connection, you are logged into your Facebook account. Now here we have to select the page that we have created on our Facebook account from which page we want to capture the post. Okay, so I'll just take you to my Facebook account. Here I have created a page named Pabli Tech. So let us find Pabli Tech here in Pabli Connect. I'm going to search for Pabli Tech page. Okay. Now the page access token is automatically captured. We are not going to make any changes over here. 
Now before clicking on save and send test request, first we have to create a new post in this particular page. So let us go to the page that is Facebook page. Scroll down here click on create post. Here we are just going to select a picture from my system. Okay, I have many pictures in my downloads, so I'm just going to select this one. Okay, and I'm just going to give a caption as public connect. New integrations. Okay, and let's click on post. Okay, and here we can find that the post has been created. Now let us move back to public connect and we are going to click on save and send test request. Okay, and here we can see the responses received and all the details related to the post are captured over here. Okay, I'll just scroll down. Here we can find the public tech page name. Okay, here we can find the uh, full picture that is the image URL. Okay, I'll just scroll down. Here we can find the message. Okay, and along with that all the other details are also captured over here. Okay, now here I want to give you an important information that here you can see that the data has captured immediately. But sometimes it may take some time in fetching the data as the trigger here is polling based. So if your data doesn't get captured immediately, don't worry about that. Please wait for 15-20 minutes patiently, your data will surely arrive. Okay, now using all these details, we want to create a pin into your Pinterest account. For that, come to this action window and here in the application name, let us find Pinterest. In the action event, we have to select create pin, click on connect, click on add new connection and click on connect with Pinterest. Pabli Connect would like to, okay, so Pabli Connect wants access. Let's click on give access over here. Authorization successful. Okay, and now the Pinterest account is connected to Pabli Connect just because I was already logged into my Pinterest account also. Okay, so make sure before creating a connection, you are logged into your Pinterest account also. Now here we have to select the board. So I'll just take you to my Pinterest account. Here I have created two boards. I'm just going to show you the boards. So the board's name is All Pins and Pabli. So I have to select this Pabli over there. Okay, if you want to create a new board, you can create it over here by clicking on this plus sign. Okay. So I just want the post to be created in this Pabli board. So I'm just going to map Pabli over here. Okay. Now here we have to map the image URL. So we have already got the post details here from the Facebook pages. So we are going to map all these details now. Okay. So I just scroll down and here we are going to map the image URL. This one full picture. Okay. Now here we have to select the title. So enter the pins title here. The maximum character limit is 100. So I'm just going to map the title over here. And the title was Public Connect. New integrations. Okay. I'm just mapping the message over here. Okay. Now here we can map the description also. But remember the character limit is just 500. If you want to map alt text or link, you can map it over here. I'm just leaving it as blank. And let us click on save and send test request. Okay, and here we can see the responses received. So now let us check our Pinterest account. Here, I'm just going to open this Pabli. Okay, and here we can find Pabli Connect new integrations. The new pin has been created over here. Okay, so in this way we can see that our integration is working. So now let's move back to Pabli Connect and let us save this workflow first. Data saved successfully. Okay, now we have to check this in the real time. For that, I'll just again go to the Facebook page and here I'm just going to create a new post. I'm just going to select the image from my system and let us select this image right now. Okay, and I'm just going to give the caption as new use cases for public connect. Okay, let's click on post. And here we can see the post has been created. Now let us check our Pinterest account. I'm going to just refresh it. 
and even after refreshing we can't find our post just because I have already informed you that the trigger here is polling based so it will take time to capture the response so let's wait for some time now it's almost five minutes let us refresh it once again okay and now here we can find five pins and a new pin has been created over here okay this was the same post which we have created on our Facebook account so in this way we can see that our integration is perfectly working fine so let's move back to public connect I'll just minimize all these windows and let us see in a nutshell whatever we have done till now so first we have created an integration between Facebook pages and Pabli Connect then Pabli Connect has captured all the details related to the new post and using all those details automatically a new pin has been created into the Pinterest account and in this way we have created a successful integration between Facebook pages and Pinterest using Pabli Connect so not just these software applications you can integrate a ton of applications and automate your business with Pabli Connect in case of any queries you can connect us to this Pabli forum to check the pricing details of Pabli Connect you can visit this particular URL also the link of Pabli Connect and this workflow is available in the description box you can clone the same workflow into your account directly if you really like this video and this video are helpful for you then please comment share and subscribe thank you everyone